How should you decide what to listen to or read in order to learn English? Often people worry that they will pick something too easy. But my recommendation is this. It's best to pick something that you can understand without too much difficulty. But that stretches you a little bit. Linguists call this comprehensible input plus one, which they describe as a material that is just one level above where you are currently. They believe that students learn a second language best when they are in a low stress situation are interested in the topic being discussed. An easy test of difficulty is whether or not you need a dictionary. You should be able to read and listen quickly with only a few unknown words per page because you understand most of the material and you can guess the meaning of those unknown words without interrupting yourself. Just keep going, you know, because you will eventually encounter those same new words again. And when you do, you will make another. Even better, guess about the meaning. And eventually you will learn new, this new vocabulary simply by enjoying real English without using a dictionary. And when you listen to a real English materials, you get the real English that is actually used by Americans, Canadians, Australians, or the British. And that's how they really speak. By replacing textbook with these materials, you will be prepared for the real world communication. When someone greets you on the street, maybe, you will understand them. When someone uses the, the common idiom, you will understand them. And eventually, you will completely understand the TV shows and movies too. So my friend, learn real English, not textbook English. Self-study paketi barədə ətraflı məlumat əldə etmək üçün bizə müraciət edin.